Hello friend, welcome back. In this video, I will discuss about how you can set up the options in your store. For finding out the options, you have to log in your dashboard area, then go to the catalog and there is the options. It's very much important part for your store. For now, I am just click on the options. When you install open card, you get by default some of the options is ready made on here like the size. You can define that things with the size, the checkbox, the color, the date, okay, date and time, the delivery date. So all the things is visible on your page like if you open this. And here it should be visible onto this area. Like if you want to uh, some of the create some of the options for your customer, like this sizes for a specific this t-shirt. So before the purchase, your customer have to choose some of the options like the M size. So what the size or the color. So you can create some of the options from through these options. So that is the things you can set up on here. You can see by default there is a color is ready made on here, size is ready made on here. So now I just want to show you the new one. So now click on the new one. So for now, I just put some of the option, this option name as t-shirt size. So, okay, I'm just putting as a main option name as a t-shirt size and type I'm just select as a select type. Okay, for now, I just adding that things on here and put that short order as equal to one and the option value name. So I'm just putting here the three option on here. It will be better now. I'm just making that thing as a S for the small size and the medium and the large size. Okay. For education purpose, I am using three of these. You can also add some of the picture if you want. For now, it's okay with me. I'm putting the short order is equal to one and then two and then three. I'm just putting the short order one and two and the three. Okay, so that's all about that value. I'm just adding that option on here. Now click on the save. So now if you want to add this option to this product, then open this product, click on the product. And in the product, just there is the product. I just want to add this option. Now click on the edit. And here is the another field for the option. Now click on the options. And here we already created some of the option for the t-shirt size. So I'm just putting as a t-shirt size. You can see that is visible on here. There is a t-shirt size. So now that is the t-shirt size. I'm just select as a t-shirt size on here. You can see that is added on here. And now if there is option for the required. So if you make the things as a required, so that you can select as a required, uh, rather than you can select as a no. Okay, for now it's okay with me. I just make the things as a required. And now I just add some of the value on here. Like I just already created some of the three option value on here. And you can see the three value is visible on here. For now, I just put the things as a small size. That should be the medium size and that should be the large size. Okay. So that's the things I just set up on here. And you can also manage your quantity like in the data option area. In the in your store that have the 100 piece. So you can define that things your with your product. Like the how many small size do you have? How many medium size do you have? And how many large size? do you have in your store okay you can define that things on here but now education purpose i am using as a 20 and that should be the 20 and this product actually in my store that have some 60 in total there is a hundred pieces in my store now there is a substrate stock so if that product is in your stock then you can select as this stock rather than you know okay and here you can also put some of the price so if you want to increase some of the price for a specific this is small size you can increase this price but now this price is actually 100 dollar so if you want to increase this price for the specific small size you can put that price on here okay but now it's okay with me and i just added two three of these on here now i save this product and now if you refresh this page yes you can see they have some other option is available on here so you choose your t-shirt and now there is an option for the small size or the m size or large size okay so whatever you want you can actually select this size from here and if you want to change that layout then you can actually do it from here like you go to the option and just open it again and in the options we just created that t-shirt side so click on the edit so now there is the type so we just select as a select so if you click on the checkbox so i'm just select as a checkbox now now save it and if you now refresh this page again so we just select that things but now we change it as a checkbox now let's check this out how that things is look like yes you can see it's much better from the select option you can see there is a actually checkbox so your customer can to select some of the sizes what the sizes they want they can choose that size okay so that the things you can actually set up with these options is very much important part as i told you and if you want to add multiple options for this product, you can also do it like click on the edit and go to the options. So by default, there have some options is created on here. You can see there is the colors. So we created one of the another new options that is the t-shirt size. I already discussed about that thing. So if you want to also edit the colors for specific this product, you can also do it like 
and here is the option you have to select and then I'm just putting the color you can see this color is comes up on here so I'm just adding the colors on here and in the color I just added the things on here you can see there is a blue there is a brown so this automatically ready-made you can see if you if edit this page so that's all the color is automatically value is ready-made on here okay and here now put the quantity so for now I'm just putting as a 50 and 50 okay for the green and the, there is the brown so there's a two color I just added on here now save this and if you now refresh this space again now you can see there is now two option is added on here there is colors the green color the brown color so your customer can choose the green color in medium size uh, rather than the brown color small size so what are the things he want at least you can manage that things from here so here you can also add the multiple options into the product page so I hope you can well understand about it and if you want to delete this one, now click on the edit and go to the option again. And there is, you can see, there is a t shirt, there is a color. For now, the color is not important for me. So I just delete these things from here and now save it. So I hope you can well understand about it, how you can manage your options and how you can manage visible that things in your page. So that's all about the options. So in our next video, I will show you how you can set up the manufacturer in your store. So thank you for watching this video. Keep learning.